What's up guys, it's Sydney and this is your 10 minute ab burnout workout. So grab a mat, no equipment needed, and let's get started. What's up guys, welcome to your 10 minute ab burnout workout. Today on the agenda we have five exercises that we're gonna cycle through two times each. Okay, 45 seconds of work, 15 seconds rest, and we're gonna go with a giant set style. So one through five, then we'll start back at the top, one through five, one more time through, okay? So come on down, have a seat with me. Your very first exercise is gonna be a seated bicycle, okay? So arms are gonna be crossed, hands on your elbows. You're gonna bring one leg in, twist and twist, right over to your knee to elbow. If you need to modify, keep that bottom foot down, step and twist, okay? Here we go, 45 seconds of work in three, two, one, let's go. Okay, so I want that elbow to twist all the way over, outside your knee at least. So you're not just turning your arms, you're turning your whole torso. If you need to modify, keep the legs down, bring it up, twist, twist, okay? Try to go nice, tall spine. Good, 15 more seconds. Here we go. 10. Pull the belly button in. Don't let your hips roll forward. Four, three, two, one, and rest. Now, I want you to throw your left leg on top of your right knee. You're gonna keep this cross as we go regular sit-ups. Okay, I want you to twist over to that knee with your opposite elbow. Two, one, let's go. Twist over and back. Modification here, bend your knees and just twist here. Okay, if that hurts your lower back, you have that option too. Here you go, exhale every time you twist, okay? Come right up and over. Don't come up and then twist. I want you to come up to the side. There you go, give me seven, six, three, two, one, rest. All right, next one you're gonna flip right over to the other leg. So cross the other ankle on top of your knee. Okay, this just opens up that hip a little more on this side to target those side abs. Here we go. Three, two, one, let's go. Sit up, twist over. And control it back down. That's it, I know it's starting to burn, you're doing great. Exhale. There we go, 15 seconds. Come on guys, you're doing great. So ab burnout, remember? Whew. Five seconds. And rest. Great job, lay it on back, on your back. Both legs out straight. Your next exercise, single leg crunch. So you're bringing one knee up to 90 degrees. Crunch, switch, crunch, switch. Ready? Let's go. Make sure you're not yanking on your neck, okay? I don't want you pulling hard on your neck. Just place your fingertips on the outside of your ears. Crunch and switch. Exhale each time you come up. Try to get your shoulder blades as high off the ground as you can. 15 seconds. Not really a modification for this one, just if you need to slow it down, you can. Squeeze those abs in as you lift and rest. All right, flip it over onto your forearms. Your next exercise is a knee tap to pike. Okay, forearm plank. You're gonna tap knees, pike, knees, pike, okay? 
two, one. Go ahead, come with me. Tap the knees and lift. Try not to bend your knees too much so you're not here, but you're bringing your whole body down, hips included, and then you're pulling it back up. Great job. Hips go down with your knees. Don't arch your lower back, keep it tight, but just make sure it drops and lifts. Great job, 10 more seconds. That's it, three, two, one. All right, we're back to the top, round number two. Are you ready? Seated bicycles, got about eight seconds. Come on back over. Whew. Last round through, you know the moves. Let's push through that burn. Three, two, one, here we go. I like to place my arms out here so I can make sure I'm not rounding my back out. Okay, the spine is nice and tall, and we've got a great torso twist going on here. Pull that belly button back in. Don't let your hips roll forward. Pull it back. All right, 15 seconds. Can you stay with me? Five, four, and rest. Ooh, that was tough for me too, trust me. <laughs> okay, right leg over the left knee. You've got crossover sit-ups. Here we go, four, three. Remember, you're sitting up, cross it over. And let's go. That's it. Up and to the left, or to the right, to your outside knee. Whichever leg you have up, elbow goes outside as you exhale. There we go. 20 seconds, and you're done with this one. Try not to use too much arm swing. You've got 10 seconds. Two, one, rest. Whew, okay, switch legs, you're doing fantastic. This is a true burnout. I know it burns, but you're doing great, okay? Let's roll back, try not to swing the arms and control yourself down. Two, one, let's go. Sit up, twist over. Here you go, breathing, breathing, breathing. Keep breathing, 30 seconds. Don't forget to control it down as well. 15. We're going right into those single leg crunches. Okay, flatten the legs out. Remember, you're bringing one leg up to 90. Crunch, switch. Okay, four, three, two, one. Let's get it. Think about forcing your abs down to the floor as you crunch. Don't pull on your neck. Just lift. That's it, breathe. You can hear me breathing heavy. It's intentional. Okay, you deflate those lungs. Give the abs room to pull down. 15 more seconds, you can do this, come on. Here we go, come on. Five, four, two, one. And rest, flip it on over, right into those forearm plank pike knee taps, okay? If you watch me for a quick second, make sure you're not dropping your knees here and leaving your hips up. Pull the hips down as your knees touch, 
and then pike. Let's go. Down, pull up. Down, pull up. There we go. Whew. All right, speed that up just a little bit. Up, down, up, down, come on. 15 seconds. Low hips, high hips, come on. Up, down, up, down, five seconds, let's go. Two, one, and rest. Whew. Amazing job, place your hands down on the mat and let's stretch those feet out. Drop the hips down, give me a little stretch here. Whew. Nice work today, guys. As the clock rolled down to zero, big deep breath, pull it back in, and slowly come on up to the top. Great job today, thank you for doing this 10 minute ab burnout with me. If you're looking for part one of this workout, you can obviously do this as a one-off, but I've also incorporated an upper body workout to go with this, so check out the link in the description. Also make sure you are eating in a way that is going to show your abs, okay? These workouts make them stronger, they give them more endurance, they give them more hypertrophy, but in order to shed the layer of fat off of the top of your abs so you can see them, you have to learn how to eat right, okay? So check out the 30 day transformation in the description below. It's 20% off right now with the code new year. And I want you guys to check that out so you can grab that nutrition program, finally learn how to eat for your body, okay? We're all not the same, but that program is gonna let you know how to customize it for your body, for your lifestyle, and let's move forward and see those results, see that body fat drop off, okay? All the info is in the description below. Make sure you check it out, and of course, Great job for working out with me today. If you finished this ab workout, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel so we can work out again tomorrow. Don't forget also to click that bell notification so I can shoot you an alert as soon as I post the next workout. Good job today, guys. Proud of you.